first one is templates. If you're going to be redoing the same thing over and over again, you don't really want to do that. You would rather put something in a template um, so that you can reuse that template over and over again. Now, I showed you that already um, when scheduling. We had um, our all teams template so that when you make, made a plan, a whole bunch of people were already scheduled to it. But I've made a template for when we do communion at this church. So let's actually go back to um, our contemporary service here. And instead of going into a plan, I'm going to go over here to the gear. And I'm going to switch over to my templates for the contemporary service. And here's where I see all of these templates. And many people can all make their own templates. I have made this communion template. Let's click on it to go into it. It looks kind of like a plan once we get in there. And when we do communion, I always have a header, the setup, a song that will pick a song uh, once it comes time, and then a prayer at the end. So I don't want to have to remember these things, so I put it into a template. Now let's go into a plan. So I'm going to hover over my plans menu. And because I was recently in this February 18th, there's a shortcut to get right to it. Let's just click right there. I am in this February 18th plan. If I want to make this a communion plan, I can go up here to where I add items to the service, but instead of adding an item, I want to import an entire template. So let's click Import Template. I'm going to choose this communion template, and I want to include all the items in that communion template, and I want to import it to this plan. Let's Submit. And all four of those items get copied from the end of that template into this particular plan so that I don't have to remember those specific things. You can import templates as many times as you want to. They are not linked. So if I go and make a change to my communion template, it's not going to change this plan. It's a one-time import action. But you can import the communion template, and then somebody else can import the hospitality template, and then somebody else can import the whatever other template. You can do those at any time, not just when you create a plan.